Yo, yo. Raj. Raj. And Mama Roots is stealing your shit already. <laughs> you silly. silly. What are you what doing? Are you <laughs> Puppies. Puppies. Hello. 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 Hi. How are you? Yeah, I do nothing. I used to do it. That's how it was over there. I used to be TV so I can do multiple layers. Yeah, I'm here the whole time. Right here. Right here. Smoke. Smoke. Good. Weed. Weed. Oh yeah. 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 Yeah, and it's got, it's got everything underneath. The lighting, filter, and that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's pretty well so far. Whoa, whoa, that's... No, we don't want that. Yeah. At this point, we're going to do a lot of shit for you. No. No. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like I I'll often unhook the TV, but it really does kind of help because then you, because with Discord you can choose multiple layers. I can like put that video there and record it, and then I can layer it with a word processor so like, I can get all the like what's happening. But then also the uh... hello cuties. This thing? That's a uh, well. Oh, hey, Goofy. Mama Rose, what do you got there? <laughs> Mama Rose, you're all tangled now. That's an arm for, for a compass, uh, like Yeti bike split. Uh, my magic arm died and I need something right away. This is the simplest version. There's so many versions of this thing to hold. Oh, this little, it's this way. Don't hold my eye out. Oh. Like, look at that. Let me see that fucking is. <laughs> protects my head the wrong way, dude. Wow. Okay. People have been like, look at this shit. Like, what the fuck are you? I know. <laughs> uh, I only got the one stick, but, uh... Yeah, yeah, if she's worried about me... I've, hit, I've come close, like, I don't want to hurt myself, like... Here, we're doing this. I'm still getting, like, one of my sets that I'll be trying to slide. I got my first mattress in 25 years. My dad's like, well, you didn't ask for one. I'm like, well, I didn't need one. Right? So I didn't ask for one. Okay, I didn't have enough. They got it to the heavy place. Yeah, we are going to fall out. It's just not screaming. Yeah, soon I can't do it. Horizontal is fine. Just got to have the right side. You see what? We treated ourselves to some really nice places, including the Ritz Carlton on South Beach. And the manager there. Ritz Carlton just on the fire. fell in love with these guys. They were talking about having to be mascots. It's a fucking terrible. That gave me the idea. Of, You're silly. There's lots of hotels here in Buffalo. And so I'm trying to duplicate what we experienced in Florida. I'm getting these pups out every day. Finding friendly places to, to hang out. Have your kids be dog walk. My kids should be some dog walkers for you. Yeah, once I get here, I'm pretty much good. Um, I don't I haven't really perfected OBS. I do. I cheat kind of in some some of the time. It's like I should I should have settings though, like so I can just do this 
like that instead of like I just have the crops and shit. So it just got like, but when you shut down so OBS, you, have on, you set up different scenes. Well, like I want that to fill the screen, right? It fills the screen there, but over here it's not. Oh, I have lock preview. That's why. Okay, so got to kind of like grab this because I want it to look decent. So I have to like scale it out and then drag it each. See there, it's kind of perfect. And then, uh, oh, oops. So do you use scenes? No, I should. Yes. I should. Um, it's a little more complicated than I have needed though. So like. No, scenes are actually wonderful. Uh, because you got those different views set up. And I also have a foot pedal that'll switch scenes, cameras, all that kind of thing. I also use a touch portal. So with one click of a button, I can change scenes and all that. Uh, and then there's something called, I believe it's mover, something like that. And it gives these slick transitions. So if I hit a key or something like that, uh, the camera, instead of just going, boom, boom, it goes. Oh, nice. animate. It's just a nice little touch. So yeah, scenes. <clears throat> if you want, I can probably set up a quick other scene or whatever. The only thing I really It'll do... It'll be your best friend. It just You don't have to keep adjusting this shit up every time. But that is a royal pain. That's more than one camera, for sure. I mean, I, it's usually can just I like... this up with a little other thing there? What's that? Can I load this up with another... You got a pipe, or what do you mean? Yeah, yeah, just, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. just put in a little pinch at it. One at a time, try to burn it yeah, completely as best. Yeah. Fuck, don't, actually, you know what? Let's do this, right? See, I, then if I don't open a preview window, I have to shut off the TV because you can't get a preview to work when two screens are hooked up. Like, if you open the preview ahead of time, though, it works. Like a windowed projector like this, and it'll show you, like, whatever you're seeing, so I can... Right. It's like... I used to be... I used to stream the windowed projector, but that, that seems to not work anymore, which is kind of a little bit annoying. But I basically... I get it going, and then I just leave it. I don't, like... I don't yeah. fuck around. That's fucking bad. I mean, I got a. The funny thing is, I replaced my broken TV with a slightly bigger one right before the iPad broke. And I use them both for work, but I would not have chosen to replace the TV first. <laughs> got a 45 for 220 bucks. It's crazy how, it's how, a 4K. how light, how cheap they are. Yeah. Like so light that it broke really fast so, like that would not have happened on my last tv my last tv took shots like that not a scratch i lost my dining room table lost it camera on it oh you broke it equipment. oh you mean it's no buried. it's a marble table but it's it's got the stamp for me, 65 inch tv monitor and all that so i'm gonna find a way to install it on the top Get everything off the dining room table, bring it out again, because I've got to start having people come over, socializing. It's just all part of the time. I've done it for years, but now that the madness aspect of COVID is gone. Yeah, finally. I find myself getting out of so much more, and it's really freaky in the beginning. It's like, I just get back in my cave and just be in front of other bunch of beings is freaking me out. But now, with all the interaction with puffs and stuff, it's Back in the rooms, comfortable with people more than ever. And, uh, yeah. Well, I'll tell you, there's nothing like having scary physical shit to wake your ass up. Hmm. So I, I'll never, ever do what I've done this whole time again. Can't, not even an option. Having a, like a normal life or the concept. Not normal, but. <laughs> Mama Rose, <laughs> that what you got, huh? Where did you steal now? Got your uh, pants there. Is that true? Uh-huh. You silly. Did not chew it. Oh, just grab it gently like a puppy and drag it around. Yeah, she won't chew it or anything. She's just trying to get attention. It works. Wow, what are you doing over there? This is this is like pure heaven for her. Look at her. All sorts of random oh, shit. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> Look at her. Enjoy Mama yourself. Rose. Hey, what you got there now? Thing. Oh, sure. that's very strong. Are you here? Uh huh. What you got there? Oh, for a rug cleaner or something? Yeah. 
sometimes I like it like this. If I put it on, if I if you go full screen with the preview with multiple things, it gets kind of like it sees itself. And like if you go for the artistic, like if you don't want for the clear crisp, like some people see that and they're like, oh, it's so fucking it's very juicy. I like to fluff people, like it's funny because people are like So um Shall we do a little scene setup? Nah, I don't need nope. that. My routine is perfect. I'll, next time, maybe, like, are you there if I can hold you? It's, just, it's all fine. It's, like, I, opening another door for me might, you know, it's, 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 it's an like, ongoing like, process, though. It's like I created a 52 minute webinar. It looked fantastic. The slides and the box scene up and over, right? Then when you do it on mobile, which is the advertising is mostly mobile, it looks like shit. So now I'm going to do that all over again somehow. So you know, it's just a awesome work. I love having a work. All the basic pieces all about the work, King. Now, baby. Actually, it's work. You can actually work. But I really Musk is an idiot. Once he decides to buy Twitter, yeah, I'm like, this is a fucking a, moron. I don't like, care for him. I don't he's, hate him. He's I don't obviously hate him. a good businessman to make money. Yeah. Like, but that's Twitter? not enough for me. He could do what he could have done with that one. Richard he, Brands. Uh, he's, I haven't heard his name in a long time. Yeah. I like him, but I haven't heard Brands' yeah. name in longer than he's doing all right. Like, I just have not seen him. Uh, I actually like, haven't. I know you got to feel Everybody's got to get right. You care for the past. Like, he's too late. They steal your lighter and the headline. Papitos, what are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Yeah. What are you looking for? What are you looking for? Happy. Nice, nice season coming up. Oh, man, I'm telling you, they're loving life. They've never had this kind of interaction. We have like about four people. now, three. What are they? Huh? Oh, two. Uh, three. Three. The best, the most city in the country. We had dozens of people surrounding us. Hey. Uh, this one woman says, you know, I've been watching with the two white dogs. This is the trail of happiness wherever you go. Boom. Yeah. That encapsulated right there. I mean, Sophia, yes, absolutely. But when you have these two puffin runners that are so exotic looking and stuff, yeah, it's, um, so it's so good for you. them and me. They're freaking touch. I don't rock this thing. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hold it up forward or. In fact, even that, whatever, it's trashy as fuck, but people, that's my five-year-old desk. That's why I hold my first and make sure you get book. pictures of this so that you can look back at this I video all of it all I mean, the time. I, I was, it's always, like, you can see, like... stage for 99.9% of my thing, now I'm in a different phase, and I look back and say, wow, I'm one persistent motherfucker. I have no idea what to take a quarter century. No idea. But I'd still do it even if I did. No, because it's, it's my badge. It's my everything. But I mean, this is a brand. I, I don't know. became unsustainable. What? Just. Well, come close with the cigarettes. Too. It's not like I. I like, smoke up there. Smoke up there. I mean, we'll take turns. Just by the fan. I, I only smoke by the fan. Oh, like, oh no, no, no. Let me I do that then. I do that in my apartment too. Yeah. Just, yeah, yeah. At least you don't got to be up there if you don't want. But, uh. It's My God, I, this little little kid had this hover thing or whatever. You didn't use it, did you? I said, let me try it. You should not do that. I should not Nobody have. I should not have. I should have. He said, oh, it's easy. I said, have you ever fallen? He said, not really. And like, fucker. He's like, hey, that's a thing in our brain. Like, I'm holding onto a pole. I step on the thing and instantly started moving it and I fucking fell. It's like, okay, thank you. Well, at least I tried. I've got an e-bike. That is my best friend because I can't ride my bike anymore because my leg's cramping. So I can do a little bit, and then I just keep the electric. With throttle, up to 20. Pedal assist, level 5, up to 28 miles per hour. It's got 4-inch fat tires. You can go over rocks, this, that. Soft, soft for my fucking ass. I never rode them. They seem fun as fuck. Like, some They're really, really good. They're really, and if I want to get total exercise, I can turn the assist down to zero. But it's a seventy, it's a seventy-five pound bike, so you can only 
pedal unassisted for so long but yeah 75 pounds. and so I'm, now i'm trying to get my hitch installed but nobody can install it because everybody's behind once i do i've got a, a bike rack that'll handle it i'm going to go up chestnut ridge different places and ride out there i don't like riding in the city that's that's not fun constantly watching for parked cars and people opening doors and shit so yeah e-bike has definitely been a good purchase that's where my money's gone business and health that's it Well, I, I need a thing to have a trailer for my two pups when oh, I'm biking. Definitely relates to a trailer. Okay. Drive from the bottom of the electric. I'm going to grab one here. So they drive from the uh, bottom of the electric wagon. And my dad's company's called Bottom Electric. And I was going to like, what if I named like, it? was company's called Bottom Electric Equipment Corporation. Equipment Corporation, right? So I was like, maybe if I just say, that's my dream. No, just in a fan or whatever. It's, I, I vacuum oh, really? Yeah. yeah, I just I vacuum up. Whatever. It's fucking... Oh, I see. Whatever. Whatever. Fuck. And why up here? Just extra space? Well, I can't use... Like, I, I can't do this down here. I, I actually no kind of like it. You know what I'm saying? I have no sink. And this is my baby desk. This I like the view from time. up here. This do you stand working. most of the time that you're working? No, yeah. I decided to smoke in here. I'm like, I'm done with my work. There's no amount of money he could charge me that would fuck with me, right? I'm like, everything's perfect, so I'm going to smoke and just write and pound it out, not go outside, just work, smoke, finish. And then the iPad, and then the hemorrhoid, the TV, the iPad, my dad ignores me. I already owe Tia some money, like, because he gives me, like, 8.5 less. He gives me, about like 8.5% less than I can survive on to do anything. So at the end of the year, I got to be like, I need, like, two, two, 2,200, because, like, I can't. Yeah. I'll do nothing. Like, I need a little liquid. And... And and he's just sort of ignored that too. I mean, I don't think he will. Like really, like I mean, if he fucks me now, I'll. I mean, it could be good for me. It could be really good. I can just publish, share every secret I have. He'll drop me on my ass. I'll go live in his basement for a couple of weeks and start like, like I was in a mental hospital for two days many years ago. Like when my dad fucked me in the ass. He, give me five grand to write a book. I told you this story, Mike. Give me five grand to write a book. I'm like, Dad, I want to write a book. I want to get away. Like I found a hyper discounted clearance cruise to Rome, right? So cheap. 1200 bucks for like 30 days all inclusive. So I'm like, can I just go on this and meet these people who are on vacation? They're much more friendly and open and chatty. And I said, pull on this right. I'll write a book. He's like, okay, fine. He's like, what about, you know, maybe just stay in Buffalo though. He's like, take the dogs, go to Starbucks, just right here. And I'm like, fine, right? I mean, he was so nice about helping me get money to write a book. I'm like, fine. How long ago is this? Long time. 20 years or something. Um, then I'm like writing and writing and writing. I just stack of pages, all handwritten, and it might not have sold, but someone that read it would have known a lot about me and probably been like, "That's some really fucking cool shit." Yeah, right? it's your first attempt. Yeah, just whatever. It's, I've tried felt, three felt, times. I've quit. I haven't been able to finish it yet. <laughs> so we just like then. Then I go to the. I go to get a little bit of money for coffee or something. There's nothing left. I'm like, Dad, just all the money's gone. And he says, "Too bad." And I'm like, but I didn't spend it. He's like, you must, you had to spend it. Too bad. Too bad. I'm like, Dad, I didn't spend it. Like, I didn't, I'm very, I know how much. Like, I'm taking out a little bit a day. Like, I got months to write a book. And he's just like, too fucking bad. And I basically just, then just like, hung up. So, like, I call my brother. I have no money. I'm like, oh, mother class. I'm like, can I buy 80 bucks? I bought some coke. And I wrote a bunch of crazy shit for my dad. It's like, this is fucked. Like, you just fucked me, right? I mean, like, you just pulled the rug out and smashed me on my fucking face. And it's not my fault at all. Because you gave me the money to write with. So, in the morning, well, whatever, it's long. So, they, they end up calling the police because I broke their TV with a sword. No. <laughs> whatever. I had to, whatever. I tried to break a face. The and I was like, fuck. So, I just hit their TV. I'm like, I, I want to go to jail, right? I, I need to get out of this fucking house. I mean, I had them watch Cry oh, Freedom man. with Denzel and Tim, I don't know who the fuck it was. They just, like, they had nothing to say. And I'm like, all right, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna break your vase. You're gonna call the police, and I'll and I'll and they'll take me out of here, right? That's it. Be like, my son, can you with domestic? Can you just, you know, can you give him a ride downtown or whatever? Just get the fuck out of here, like, for peace or whatever. Mama Rose. But my dad shows him what I wrote. My dad shows hey. he shows the cops what I fucking wrote him. Like, like this could kill me. Like you fucked me, right? Like I'm, I have nothing, and you're fu and you're telling me you're like too bad. So they took. So then they took me to the. Uh, it was crazy. Oh, whatever. So you ended up in a psych ward for two days? Yeah, I turned the whole place around. It was empty when I got there. The place filled up. I had ping pong tournaments going. 
There was this dude with a giant nose that we called Richard Steen. It was just fucking weird. The doctor and the bike, like, this dude's a piece of shit. Like, he told me when I got here that I had an hour to tell my story. He told me to stop after five minutes. And I'm like, you just told me to tell you the fucking story. You just come, like, it's a piece of shit. These people are disturbed in here, right? You don't know how fucked up. Just, just a fucking piece of shit moved by, like, oh, what, the, the head of that hospital was such a piece of shit. He should never have been around anybody with any illness fucking ever. Maybe when he was younger, but he was gone. He was fucked, like, oh, that was, I don't know what the point, I don't know, I don't know what, if what I ever what. told you, but I had a nervous breakdown for 10 months. Suicidal, uh, tried to end my life twice. That's back in the day, though, right? Yeah. How many? One. So, they wanted to put me on lithium and Fred as a Yeah. Yeah. I remember the psych ward that night. Hearing this woman screaming. She was just tied down and stuff. I thought that's me. And, uh, yeah, I had to stop driving a car. I couldn't do the dishwasher. My brain just totally short circuited. Right. And I knew what was going on, but I had no words to describe it. And I would try to describe it to people to try and save my life. Right. And uh, nobody first got it. Uh, but then it um, it kind of just went away after about two months. Yeah. It burned itself out. Yeah. Just one. Uh, I don't even know why the fuck I told. What's the point of that story? The desk, the water, the what was the point? Funding five thousand dollars. Yeah, but like what? Like it's only like it something to do. I, I don't know. It doesn't fuck it. Um, but it's part of our story. It was a really, really fucked up. Like, I mean, I got out really quickly. They came out. My grandpa came down. Like I could have escaped many times. I really thought about it. Like they take your shoelaces, but I made shoelaces out of paper. And they were good enough that I definitely, like, easily left. But then I would have become, like, a legal, like, then that would have been a legal thing. Because that paper had some, like, you could kill me. Like, I could die. Like, this could fucking destroy me. And then when you say that, like, it could kill me, blah, blah, you say enough. And they're like, we're going to have, you're going to go for a uh, diagnostic, right? we got to make sure that it's some crazy shit right here, right? Like, the law is what we got to do. The, the, PM, the EMTs took my bowl for me. They got a pipe, like, like, they took it for me. They held it. Like, I mean, everyone was... Fucking unbelievably friendly. The nurse, I was drawing. Mama Rose! Hey, silly. What are you doing? This is paradise for her, man. She gets to steal and steal. Look yeah, at you're look rolling the fucking face. paradise right now. You better, you. you better watch out. Rose. <laughs> I feel like their tails are chilling my legs a little. It's kind of nice. Hello. They often wag in phase. Yeah, yeah. 180 out of degrees out of phase. Yes. You two are silly. I, I don't know they, about... They walk at the same time when they run they press their bodies together and they run as one it's just they're amazing i'm saying i didn't know any like i don't know about anybody with one dog but you used to have one dog right like you only had something back in the day Sophia. two is so much better oh, i mean it is but it's 10 times the, the work oh oh it's just incredible the city is just the fact that they have two buttons is Every, I realize something. I'm a hyperbole. I'm probably 1.4 times. Come on. Like, people are so hyperbolic as fuck. It's like, I'm just saying, like, what do you want? Let me kiss, kiss. <laughs> Thank you. You know I like that. Not a kiss from you, probably not. Not a kiss, kiss. Kiss, kiss. He got hit by a skunk six oh. weeks ago. Hey, kiss, kiss. <laughs> Sit. Sit. Good puppies. Good puppies. I need a kiss. Hey. I need a kiss. Chill, 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 up. I need a kiss. Chill, chill. I need a kiss, okay? I need a kiss from you. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Yeah, the video didn't catch that one. They're so the same and so fucking different. It's incredible. She's Mama Rose, man. She's the boss. What do you think it is, really, though? Finish last thing. Like, 1.4 times, like, they, they make it worse than... For you, like, it's a little worse than two it, times? It, it was... Just, three times, two dogs? Five, like, yeah. That's all I can say. If they're young, you mean, when they're flicked with you. Oh, it, it, we still have our... Sure. I don't know, but my huskies, man, the more... Like, all, it, like, I, I love a, dealing with all of them at once. <laughs> just unexpected stuff. Just little things that complicate just walking them. Things getting tangled. This one going this way, the other going that way. Shit like that. But oh, thanks for fucking biting a hole in my water bottle, you fuck. <laughs> They don't understand English like that. They don't know fuck. Either. 
Like, it's not your words, it's your tone, you fast fuck. Oops, sorry, I said it again. Mama Frost, what do you got now? <laughs> She's gonna forever love this place outside. <laughs> so you and your younger sister are so close, though? We are close, but she's just paying us to deal She's like a little four foot dino, five foot, whatever she is. And we got into two fights, and the thing was totally on her, I have to say. But then we were both able to let it go an hour later, and we had a great time. But I extended my trip by four days. She went flew back home, and I was like, got my own space now. Well, you're not going to use the new meat sheds, let's get to it. Yeah, no, I, and, and she gave all that shit up. Wait, it was a girl? I, it didn't stop. I thought it was a, your nephew. Wasn't it a boy? Wait, Wait, what what you, you we, didn't your nephew see you weep oh, back I in the day? Oh, I my sister the cage. You talk about Nick. Yeah, how's he doing, dude? Yeah, I... Which one is he? Uh, girl. Uh, 22. And the younger sister's And I consider him to be part of the team and stuff, but he's the youngest of the four The younger one is far, the older one. What do you mean? Now, because of this family thing going on, Sue and I are fucking... Black sheep with a family. He has to call me. Ugh. Awesome. If you're going to be a black sheep, might as well be a white knight if you got to be a black sheep. Hmm. A lot of black sheep are white knights. Getting back to standing versus sitting. So I started getting cow bone pain. And it still wins. It comes and goes. And now I got the GI thing. Tough, right? So I stop sitting. I stand 100% of the time. Well, it turns out. That that has negative effects too, and it started creating weakness and sufficiency in my legs and the cramping. Well, I'm extending all the time. So it's you. it's about you know ideally like every thirty minutes or so change from standing to sitting or it's my body. So, but I'm so used to standing now that I don't like to sit. Uh, so yeah, it's an ongoing thing. But taking more breaks is the fun of getting the fuck outside. Oh, well, there we go. Okay, we do it like that. So all, this is just a straight preview. That's the well, that's Discord, the real Discord, full screen, and then this is just a preview, full screen with only one. I like the turning though. I really like the, the chair, and it's not super smooth, but it's almost like a nice little rotation. Wow. I mean, it's actually what that's there for. The reason that's modern is for this. If I'm sitting, like I don't know if I'm handwriting something potentially or so I gotta have all options available. I just point this down, switch this. I haven't handwritten since this this thing. Um, yeah. Got it. I cut a hole in my rug with wax on it. I was bored. I was like, I'm fucking. I'm gonna start to chop this apartment. I'm fucking. I'm spending, <laughs> spending at least twenty grand when I leave. Like, you gotta repaint. You gotta put a new. You gotta put in everything new. That whole thing small. So when I start, I'm like, fuck off. Like, I'm. Just... <laughs> fuck. I gotta get creamer. This fuck. I didn't put enough in. I got. Uh, you drink black coffee or you drink it? I go back and forth. He had some extra food stamps, so a couple times she bought me some like extra stuff that was kind of nice. She's like, I did it so you can pay me back faster. I'm like, well, I don't have any money right now, so you just gotta like, you gotta wait on that fucking 1600 until that I have that 1600. Well, Thank God. I take a look to my friend Angela. It was the worst thing I ever fucking did. I couldn't wait to pay her back. Well, she doesn't really have a choice. I just said she could report me, but like, I'm just like, she knows she'll get her money. She got some money from COVID, some unemployment shit that was just someone's like, she's like, yeah, I work for years, but she's like, well, fine, whatever. They say apply, she applied, and then she got money. So she's not, so she doesn't have, she wants to take all that and buy a house. She's going to get a free house. From fucking sex thing, she's gonna she's gonna get a free house. How's it? Huh? How is she getting a free sex thing? Like Belmont, like she's gonna get a free house. I mean, oh. she has to put a little like no big. Oh no, she's most of it's like eighty grand is free out of a hundred or some shit. If they pay for it, she gotta stay there for a certain number of years. If she like, in any in any case that I get something done, well, she's gonna have to sell well, the house well, back. Yeah, well. I don't fucking know. She's good with paperwork. She's sweet. Gosh, she's on disability. So, are you sure it's your motherfucker? You motherfucker! Mama Rose! Mama, you mama fucker! Hey! Where are you going? He's gonna, he's gonna walk away with my fucking chips. Bring those chips over here. Mama Go chips, Rose, Bring it here. Come on. 
Oh, look, 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 look. Hey. Come on. Let me see that. Let me see. Down. Drop it. Hey. Down. Can you put that down? Release. No. Repent. It's supposed to be Retract. Give. Give. Relax. Give. 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 Hey. Give. <laughs> Give. What are you doing? You're not listening. Give. Let me see, but we're still working right now. Give. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. That was very sweet. I think if I had dogs now, I would have to, I would buy a Roomba and put a dildo on it or like something on it, some big rubber toy that says I don't chase the fuck around. I think I'll need a little box. I have a pile of toys that would overflow that box. Yeah, that's, that's the thing. The and they get bored of it, or they tear the shit out of it. They're retrievers, they don't retrieve the ball. I mean, it's ridiculous. What am I, uh, 120? It's a weird hour, dude. Like, this is when I get up. So, let's see some, one, one thing that is still very clear. Having it been in the face of, like, you know, collection and stuff, which you've been in for a year or two. Yeah. When you freshly, kind of like on the other side, where there's a singular project, singular focus, and everything <laughs> you know, clarified the messaging so people get it, I mean, all the difference in the world, I knew it, struggled with it, but now that I've had to give it a it's like, that's right, that's all that's needed. The ability to communicate my out there ideas to an everyday person when they say, oh, I get it. That's it. That's the whole game. Well, and so that's what I see. That is my shit. And that's <laughs> that and that's what I see for uh, my you shit. still is if you can pin one project out and have a two, three paragraph description so you think that if people are shaking their heads up and down, that will change. Yeah, it's really Every fucking day. hard. It's really hard, but I am a coalescer, so the paragraphs can be about the project and without going into any of the individuals. You'd be like, there's a lot here, but we don't have time to get into it, right? Like, if you decide That's to go right. one step further, there's a huge deck of cards. See, but my like, whole team, they all know that do they you say too much. Go here or not? Uh, 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 nice uh, and easy choice that they make themselves, make it attractive, and. Well, I, I, I had to make it about it's up to me to have a clarified, simplified, singular message. And I still struggle with it. My team all knows that I give too much information because I know my stuff so well. It's like, Carl, I don't need 12 pitfalls for this Oh, yeah, you probably need less, what? sure. Just you probably need to, to boil down to. I mean, you can say a lot with a little. That's what I've like, done. Profound things that's are generally not 36 words long. That very thing in this page. And that's what I clearly see for, uh, for you and have seen. Because I can wait to it so much. Oh, and it might be quite the struggle. But, and, and people like you have a perfect uh, meter for it. Because all of a sudden, instead of being bombarded with 10,000 thoughts and ideas and stuff, uh, which we do, uh, they get one, and they're going to be shot. It's like, you're going to go silent after 30 seconds, or you're going to hand them a slice of paper with one page description, with all the details that you can tell. You got any plans? Like, is there any... You know what I mean? I mean, do you hear that, what I'm saying? It's yeah, like, and I have yeah, a response. But is there some point at which they, they see something, and then you provide them with the opportunity to talk? Like to record something, like they read something, and they're like, anytime, this whole thing, right? You're reading, you're learning, you're going through these exercises, like where they can, like something built into that, where they can, they can inject DNA. Because that's what I do with my, like I do with my stuff, but when it gets there, it's like, you have these things, but you can break them apart. You can add your own shit, you can add notes, and speaking is the way of the future. Well, I'm not talking strictly about presenting here's a project that I need for a team and uh, funding for. And if you can put that description, one page, and, they, and you start seeing this from people. That's it. That's all that's needed. In my experience, and uh, yeah. But it's the world's hardest most part thing to do with minds like ours, because we do have that in common. We love divergency. Convergency is a singular point, bringing all that stuff into one point. It's not more like your focus. And it can be a moving point. It's not a permanent point. It's not the only point. But it's a start. There's a medium sized line yeah. between focus and like just the hum of a plague of locusts. Like, you just. <laughs> not yeah, a very thin line. You should know the difference. But... Not, I, 
Like I'll I'll think that I simplified it and I'm only getting three points, and it's still too much. For it's all right, all right, fine. We've done one. A social media person says, you know, I, I they looked at my thousand and one lives, five, ten, forty minutes. No, they want us to go uh, TikTok, uh, eleven, ten seconds, Google, thirty seconds. And I'm, I'm okay. I'll do it, and I know I can do it. Uh, in a necessary thing, but it's very unnatural. And tick, what's uh, it? I, I want to give people the whole picture. Well, you can do that one after picture. the other. You link them together. You make one That's good right. and then move. But, but TikTok's it's, terrible for sequential videos. But, but the key for me that I want to remind myself is uh, when I meet somebody for the first time, it's not about shoving the football and hot dog down the throat. It's about giving them one bite and say, if you want more, come to my site. I mean, also hot dogs are gross. I mean, that's that's how it's done yeah, in relation to people who've never seen or heard our shit before. One piece, that's it. I mean, could you actually do that? I don't know if you could. I could. Will I? No. And and that is the to me the top only priority moving forward to getting into a new phase where all of a sudden we will have people funding and everything, whether it be through your dad or anybody else. You could raise funds for a clarified idea through Clubhouse. Oh, my dad will give me money if I give him one idea. He will. I don't have one idea. I have 1,400. And 10% of them are real ideas. I'm like, if you can't sit down, this is what I'm going to ask him. Like, All I'm asking is that you sit down with me, nice, beautiful little deck of cards, and however long it takes, a couple weekends, you look through, and you throw one in the garbage, and you and any of them that you actually like, slide them into this side, and I'll only deal with it's, it's, it's just one at a time. It's one idea at a time. Right, but it's swipe or swipe. Goal. No, I'll say you only see one. You only see one at a time. When when you make a decision, if you don't, if it, it means nothing, swipe left. If it if it means anything, if it you know, then swipe right. Put it in a deck of enriched ideas. Like my shit's already ri- enriched rough as fuck. This uh, oh, where'd it go? This list here. These are all real. Those are all fucking real. I'll build a business on any of these fuck. And there's four hundred of them. Any of them. They're not all that good. But with a lot of work and personality, like you can make any like anything. You add other so IP so and service, same, whatever. Same and... thing. Whoa. You recognize it. And last thing I'll say for moment on it is, if you are ever in a decided place where it's like, all right, let's try this out. Just one singular message. I could absolutely be a catalyst for that. We could get back on Discord and we could practice. We could have it done in less than. If and when you are interested and ready to do that, I'm ready now. Like I'm tomorrow, when you when you want to talk again, just let's do. Let's make sure we're set up so we can also do yeah. remote. It's just okay. This this here, this one, ready. So I have. I'm gonna review my own videos too. I have, so I, I would, but before you go to that, I'll, I'll say we'll close the my thought for this. So I I I invited you to work together, come up with one page, something. So you recognize from what I hear the value of outcome. You also recognize the challenge of doing it. So But I mean I don't even know what it is though. Like I don't know. I mean, that's part of the process. Like I, I, I You could literally do this. I don't even know the name of it. I don't know the fucking name. I have so well, many names, I don't have a name. The play care did seem to Play care is great. My dad likes play care too. Why don't, is there any sense you would talk to my father? Would you talk to my father like and interview him? After the one page thing is done, yes. Eh, we'll think about maybe also before. Like, page or you said like paragraph? I'm you mean big the text, page. right? I'm like, the big te- just kind just of large. You know what I'm talking about. It's, it's an overview snapshot of the like a little idea, smaller text than that written. The idea, right? what it's about, and then what's needed to have it. It's actually a really simple thing, but it's hard to do. Just to pin down that one thing was so, literally impossible for me to do. So the one thing that I'm focusing on actually encapsulates everything else, but it's entered as a single point now. That's the difference. So if you have a thousand and one ideas, if you can have a single point entry that's palatable to people, then you're off and running. That's all that's needed as far as I can tell. I mean, ultimately that... And I'm happy to help with that. Uh, and so if you... I, I won't necessarily come to you and try to talk into that. But if you come to me and say, all right, let's do the one page, I'm there. 
because I really um, do uh, have the conviction. I mean, there might be, there might be, that'll make all the there might be multiple options for you though. There might be more, like, you're, you're yeah, like, which but, one do you like? Because they're not going to be exactly the same. Oh, they're different ideas. You're Three pages, like, yeah, different, different takes. And you say which one of these you think oh, best explains it. Like, so there, I, I, there's different ways to come at it, and I don't have uh, like definitive. Um, I do. I think that if I can be um, pretty effortless and help with that, because I have been so convinced of doing that myself, I've come to the other side, comparing <laughs> the read, and uh, I think I can help. And that's the only way, main way, most significant way. It's hard. <laughs> Getting somebody like us down to one thing, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, what, what it'll probably end up for me is this. Just like, not fucking I can, give you, I can give you a guess. But yeah. when I made the decision, it's like, you know what? All right, done. I don't care how hard, just done. Pick one. What What's the thing that excites me the most or the people connecting with two and stuff? Play care. In my, from what I've seen, the idea, that's an obvious thing. I mean, I build a car. We we prototype that right here, though. We don't even need a space. We can the freeze one. Think that would be a fantastic place to start, in my view. But is your mind capable of staying focused on that? In my case, I wasn't. I mean, sort of. I don't know. We'll see what we'll see what I I work on next. But I mean, I've been working like talking and talking and talking and talking and talking and talking. Actually, I'm not going to show you. You're diverting. And that is a blessing and it's a curse until we get to the next phase where we get into the conversion. It's the open funnel is where we thrive, but then it's got to get funneled into the the closed funnel so one drop comes off. Uh, So, actually, you know. So, do you think I'm pretty spot on with how I'm looking at where? What, where you are and what and what will make the difference i mean sure but like i mean i yes i also knew you think that i get it yeah but i mean i knew that like i just had it's good Me to too. hear it like should i it's i mean a question of being able to execute that years i tried it I couldn't do it. I mean, it could be, for me, it might be like, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to write a book, and in that book is going to be only the pages you're talking about. Like, yeah. every big idea has a page, and that's like yeah. it. And like, the next book will be, well, pick which one you like. When you when you pick your favorite page, and I know what it is, then I'll go deep as fuck into that one. But like, and mainly it's probably going to be literally a randomization. Like, you're, they're going to get a random card, and it's going to have like a few words, and that's fucking it. And if they don't swipe, I don't care. If they're not, if, if the first word, if the universe doesn't align that first word such that they look at a second word... I don't I really probably don't give a fuck. Like if, if there's a basic app that can do it, I don't care. If they swipe a few though, they're gonna finish the deck. And when they finish the deck, the data academy will know what our best idea is. Like what our fucking best idea is. And once we know what our best idea is, which I cannot determine because I'm just some fucking dude, then we then, then we make that and that's it. What's most popular? Here's We're gonna build that first and make a bunch of money and then we'll see how about building the rest of them. One way to see potentially have a good idea well they're all good ideas uh, and the real ones uh, uh, so uh, an idea that stands out um, uh, amongst all the others that could actually be a good vehicle for officially getting into the execution phase they actually generating red they have they actually have it. rest uh, I'm a revenue. Again, when people started shaking their head up and down. I see, oh my god, I'm making sense all of a sudden. And without that feedback, there's no way because I was always in my head trying to figure the shit out, and that's not going to do it. That feedback loop from an external person, especially those who don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, meeting them for the first time, and I talk to, and I practice like multiple times a day when I'm talking with my pups. And I still need work, and I have good days where I'm clear, and then bad days where I just like I get too much. <laughs> I've met this dude in a bar at Key West. Love that first piece I, I I offered, and then I once I saw that, I said, "Oh, and here's another thing." Blah, blah, blah. And I walked into the outside so I could talk more. And at one point, I said, "Dude, I, I love it, but I, I, I gotta get back. I gotta get back now." It's like. Yeah. Put you on vacation. Put you on vacation. You gotta understand. Like, but any situation, anyone, any time, investor or grandma, if I can give one piece and stop. On the rare occasion I've been able to do that, I'm getting positive. 
thoughts. I left a guy early last night, actually. I met a guy's name. I was just looking around. His name was, and I'd used this word earlier in the day, which is divisionaries. And his name was Divisionary. So I'm like, do you, when did you use that name, right? I'm like, I just wrote that shit in a list of Ideopolis. And like, I'm a, I'm Divisionary. He's like, I'm an Aries. I got all these Aries words. I'm like, you're Divisionary. It's close. So I said hi. And he came in. He's from New Zealand. Very cool. And I kind of like left around. I'm like, yeah, I got, well, you know, I got to, I got to go. Like, kind of like Seinfeld, right? Like, leave when you're ahead. Like, I'll stay forever. Now I'm kind of like, yeah, maybe that's not the thing to stay in the fucking room talking with people forever. Like, maybe it's right to, Unless you can really finish something, to just kind of leave when something's good, because you're going to talk again, and you'll, you'll be fresh then, you know? Sometimes I try to finish things that day with a new person, and they're like, I can't osmose my brain into theirs in a week. Like, what the fuck? Sim like, names are not so complicated. That's way of putting it. I've been asking too much. Of my, uh, like, probably a lot. I do. I ask way too much from people, and it's it, that's not effective. It, it's not. That, that's not. Danielle, the interviewer, what she said is, you know, you've identified yourself as you know, something that's broken brain, cognitive. that's all real and stuff, but you're also a genius. And I think differently than other people, and you don't realize it, you expect other people, because this stuff comes so easily to you, and you even try to simplify it, but you're still giving them way too much, because it, to you, it's like, oh, I simplified it, it's not easy, well, it's like, no, it's not. Even a simple idea outside the context of one's paradigm is going to short circuit their motherfucking brain. Yeah. The simplest idea, like my whole idea of life is a wave, is based on one idea. Life is movement, movement both expansion. Simple idea, but to sink their teeth into it so it actually makes sense, it's not so easy. What about life is a wave? Simple idea. Maybe you need a hand. But you, know, but you know what I'm saying? It's like, and then I get pissed off at people. It's like, come on, man, this is so clear, don't you get it? And they're usually polite, but, you know, you know when somebody gets it. And that's that's the difference. It's really not the money I got. It's not anything other than messaging it. All those pieces, including the money, work. Well, the money, yeah. I, well, the money, I, get, the I, money helps your brain a lot. I've it's, heard too, but it definitely helps. Like, when you have runway... It helps. I'll it might stress this. out, but it fucking uh, helps. I'll say this. Eggs are fundamental to a cake. Um, but if I don't have the other ingredients, in this case, uh, the wheat, uh, whatever. Um, metaphor, but um, if I don't have a clear message, I could have $10 million. It won't oh, matter. It's going nowhere. Yeah, and, and, and I could have nothing. You know what I mean? It doesn't, it doesn't, it won't really stop you. It makes things just harder. Money makes things easier. Yeah. You all you need to do is walk on the and street. It also and, makes it fucking hard I mean, at the same time. I mean, if you won twenty million, day. if you won twenty million, you could and you just walk down the street with the dogs. If you just got on a backpack and walked, I mean, your your legs, you're not gonna walk. Whatever, your electric bike or whatever. Something you got a trailer behind you that's got twenty pounds of batteries built in. Whatever, then you work gradually on it. You, you know, you do the right amount of pedaling and then you and then you chill. Or you have the dogs. You have your dogs pulling your bike just for to film, right? Dogs pulling your bike behind your bike is a trailer. And when you snap that trailer onto your bike, you have a parrot lighter, I wasn't done. I don't. I'm. I'm very bad with tolerating interruptions. Sorry, right. So you have the trailer. It snaps on. It's got a a motor. The, the well, actually, it's not for an e-bike, or it could be. And it snaps onto the rear axle, and there's a motor here, so you can do that. Would be for a non-powered rear one, right? Um, but then when you disconnect it, the bike from the trailer, it's got three wheels. It's got two wheels back here, and 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 then you fold the 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 front part. Well, it's, these things are triangles, right? So the front wheel is powered by it, right? So when it's connected to the bike, it, it feeds and has power from its trailer, right? It's got a pretty decent sized battery underneath it. When you disconnect it, the kids can drive it around at whatever app settings you want, like a nice fucking three wheeler with a fucking roll bar on it. So they all of a sudden have like something that's like one of these shitty fucking plastic Tonka trucks, except for made of like aluminum or titanium and matching their dad's bike. And you don't have to sell millions of things if they cost. 667 and the dad says that's the sweetest electric trailer i've ever seen it triples my bike range my kids can i'm in but i mean actually that would that you could do it probably i think that's actually that that idea is probably for a non-electric bike you, when you when the trailer attaches to it the motor's in the end of the handle and it fuck you just have the little adapter where you go to a bike shop spends 32 minutes so when it snaps on it drives the rear wheel or drives the wheel of the trailer what are you saying? Forgot. 
that got fucked up just because of the like three seconds of no you're very respectful a lot of people have actually been being better like if, you, if you're very gentle people will talk like they'll just go right through you and if you're too nice they will just anytime they'll just start talking then you back off and that's just what happens right you just back off that's i mean very hard to do well <laughs> uh, well the, the dream is i tell you this is my dream it's to be in a room with 12 other people we're all sitting there like space like chairs they're amazing and they have those things that old ladies dry their hair with comes down right so i'm talking and everyone's sitting there listening they're excited but the thing is as soon as anyone moves their lips to talk this thing goes <laughs> no so so the end of this episode i'm talking right nobody's fucking listening because they're all recording their own shit in their own fucking world nobody's being interrupted right if everybody wants to start talking they can't unless you give them the tech to do it unless you can shunt them and the internet's way better for that in reality it's fucking hard to do when you got 12 people really just one can talk or you got multiples crossing the bigger the groups get though the more listening there is which is great for a speaker it's not so great for somebody who wants to engage in a conversation it's like i'm like i get one twelfth of the speaking time and i gotta listen to 11 normies who don't have any passion that's that's activated like nothing against them y'all do respect but like that i can't i'm 49 years old i cannot listen to this 20 year old tell another anecdote i don't i'm not like even if i do diss them by accident i will diss them respectfully like i just don't have time i don't have time to listen to another fucking story the world is burning you're blessed as fuck it's good to meet you you know but if you want to talk small like there's some you other know, balls in the field to play with right i just i can't i say that to a lot of people now some of them get upset sometimes it results in a really good conversation but i just people talk so long about so much about anything with anyone like so do you ever interrupt them of course I do, but like I'm trying to make it them realize that if they if they don't interrupt me, I won't interrupt them, and I'm the only one calling attention to it, right? Like I'm like, excuse, like Shiva taught me this, like excuse me, if if we're civilized, if we're not going to tell civil lies or be like uncivilized, then then when someone's talking, as long as you're in a conversation, you start talking fine, but if they don't stop immediately, like if they don't just back, then you stop, like and if you don't, you then you're fucking with them, and then go find another friend who'll play by the rules. People don't have anything. We don't have anything. I, I like contracts. I like smart contracts. I like building a society that has data so it can understand itself so the future knows what the fuck happened when we build a better world. I, I think data can help us, right? I think, I, like, I don't like when Apple, I don't like when Amazon uses it against us, but we can own our own shit and use our own data and it's worth a fortune. Not like for you to take cash from your data, right? But to us, you find out, like, tell the truth, like, just tell the truth. Answer these fucking questions. I think that's the thing. I, I'm going to be a questionaries. Answer these questions. And at the end of answering these questions, we're like, you will know a ton about us. And we will know as much about you as you want us to know. Right? If you get through, if you answer all the questions, we'll have a shit ton. And all these a couple good questions in the beginning, they get invested and they realize, you know, why why couldn't one of these huge companies be be owned by its customers? Like now, what what is stopping citizen sourcing from becoming a real thing? Probably an alpha million. Nothing. Balls are good. Balls are good. Pills are bad. Balls are good. Really? Oh, it's the oh, rubber oh. is off seal, oh. and so she gets a little extra sweet and y'all should try that to get them to like get bald it's like really hard but you like that one yes you do interesting all this time i see a broken ball <laughs> and now she's it's hers and she goes to the bed and she will then sleep with whatever she's stealing that is a like i that's like a shitty bed that rocco you know rocco right he gave me a bed he was getting a new bed or something. He gets to me. When I open up the cover on it, I realize, like, almost all of it is shit foam. It's not a separate feed at all. It's shit foam with a tiny layer. I, my dad finally gets me a bed for, like, 500 bucks. Look at it. The it's only this. This much is tempur -Pedic. And it's fucking garbage. Like, it's fucking, like, and, and that's what happens when you let other people finance your, your shit. Like, when you rely on big people and profiteers to build your shit, you're going to get what the fuck you should expect. Topper. Five years and your shit is wrecked. It's trash. Any mattress. I mean, the top is fucking. But I think we. I think 
first of all, I think we can make a mattress that is twin size and the most comfortable thing in the world. Like, listen, and then you can have like a bigger mattress, but the really good shit you need is for your hips and your shoulders, right? And your and here, that's it. There's just one area in the middle of the bed where you actually put your weight that that needs to be the expensive shit. Like, I, dude, there's so there's so much. I'm gonna beat Ben Franklin. I'm sorry. I will beat Ben Franklin. I will beat him. I, I don't know if I'll beat Twain, but I will beat him. Like open sorcerers of the world. People who found ideas and gave them the fuck away. Ben Franklin only had a couple. I mean, yes, he helped build America, but as an inventor, lightning was already found anyways. He was the first, like, to get recognized and spread it. But, like, and and my favorite story in the world a couple weeks ago was the idea of what would Ben Franklin do if he didn't give away the lightning rod? How the fuck was he going to enforce a patent on a metal fucking spike and a wire? So the whole show is, it's like a virtual reality show where Ben Franklin travels the world as a patent troll, right? Like, what if Ben Franklin weren't an open sourcer? What if he said, I want all the money. I invented this bitches, right? I invented the lightning rod. Your house isn't burning down. Give me the $20. And they're like, Ben, how about dinner? I'd be like, fine, I'll take a dinner. I'll take a dinner. It's good. I mean, be, and be filming that shit. And I'd be like, well, Ben Franklin could not have gotten the money anyway. So it's not such a big deal that he gave away the lightning rod. It's not such a big deal. He couldn't have monetized it for fuck all. And he already had money anyways. That dude was a brilliant motherfucker, though. Like, a real, like, Smarter than us, possibly, like, a brilliant motherfucker, and, I mean, a totally different world, but his dad sold him into slavery to his brother. It was very different from our parents, like, oppositional shit, tough as fuck, he was supposed to make candles, and his dad, like, hated that shit, just raw fat and shit, right, like, just nasty as fuck. But, like, there aren't that many open sorcerers. Tesla signed away his patents, but he didn't originally, he didn't originally go to give them away. Like, Westinghouse was gonna go broke, so he ripped them up. I don't know, like, Westinghouse didn't say, how about we just suspend royalties until we're good? Why didn't he say that? Like, Westinghouse is another brilliant motherfucker. He could have... And Tesla died poor. Poor. Someone was paying for, like, his hotel in, the, in, 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 like, the Ritz, I think. But, like, that he was relying on other people that appreciated him. He had no money. And maybe... I mean, he's one of the biggest inventors ever. Sure, the AC motor would have been discovered otherwise. Fine. Um, no Nikolais. <laughs> no Nikolais! Yeah, I'm not gonna build, I'm not gonna build any inventions. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a deck of cards. I'm gonna approach magic at some point, but, but listen, you guys have a pretty cool game, mad popular, but you're not your printing capacity is way beyond what you're using, right? You've reached saturation. I have something called Israel, it's a card game. If you wanna go magic is real, if you wanna work with me and use your facilities which are underutilized, like I'm happy to work with you. And I'm happy to work with you. And you guys wanna profit? Fine. We're not a for-profit, like, but if you want a profit, fine. You're another business. I will do business with for-profits, right? I don't want to be one because I see what happens. My dad is so it holds on to his money so tightly that he ends up only giving me money that, that's necessary for me to survive because he's afraid yeah, to be but poor. Are there it's crazy. To that? I would have to say yes. To what? Which part? What? Where? Yeah, for profits. There are examples of for profits that don't think to me well. Well, okay. Let's say for cash, profits are bad. Every time they give you back oh. a dollar. Oh, to me, always. Practically, I will never fuck with them. I'll do business with them, but I, there's no need to build one. A benefit corporation or, like, benefitness, I believe in that. I believe that if you if you are financing a company, whatever the fuck it makes, they better be providing that thing to you at a better price than someone on the street, right? If you're an investor in McDonald's, you should get some kind of a fucking deal, and you never do. They don't give a fuck about you. They don't care. You get nothing. It's just you give us money. And we give you more money. And I say, but wait a minute, you're gonna give them that money, they're gonna pay taxes on it, and the tax rate's gonna be pretty high. And then they gotta go buy something. Mama Rose, careful now. Then these fucking idiots gotta go hey. buy gotta go buy something from Amazon, right? They gotta go buy something from Amazon, which is cheap, but it's another fucking stupid fucking step that they have to take to try to achieve convenience. You, you don't need those steps. If you invest in a great company, that company says, here's what we're gonna do for you. You never have to do any of this bullshit again, right? Whether we manufacture it. Where we get it from Amazon, you don't deal with it. And we'll give you all these tools to look ahead at your life. Figure out how much ketchup you want within 20% and order for 10 years now. The savings will, in conjunction with us, will blow your mind. And if they don't offer us a good enough price on ketchup, we will invent our own brand and our own bottle and we'll sell it to our own people. And it'll be like the house brand and it'll be good as fuck because they suck money out of every product. If you stop them from sucking money out of every product, all you really need to do is find people that are just not poor enough that they can start it. And that's it. You don't need to extract money from your investors. Your investors are the people that fucking matter. The investors come first. In my case, they're citizens or they're nothing. I don't give a fuck about business. I give a fuck about people. I just don't care. 
And when I say I beat Ben Franklin, it's because my dad thinks I'm a fucking retard and never gave me a fucking tool to work with. So all it was was my brain and a camera for fucking 25 years. So what I do, I'm a retard. I'm a childish retard. I'm saying I must work. My mother made me to be a good person. I'm, we're super blessed. We must work. Right? We must work. Must work. Try to do something that's fucking good because something good was done for us and we love people. What else is there, right? Like, try to do something good. For others. That's how you become happy. You don't become happy. You can't make yourself happy. It's ridiculous. It's like oxymoronic as fuck. In a world like this, I don't think you can make yourself happy. There's some kind of a bubble you're in. If you're not doing for others, you're not happy. To me. Generally speaking. The assumption is that the external world is is the determination of, determinator of my happiness. Well, it's all the other internal worlds that are part of your family. The external world that should have this perception response to it. Power back to can I be unconditionally happy? Yes, and it's a dynamic. I don't even consider it in terms of happiness. I actually, I was never thinking. I don't know. The, the, un, the unconditional shit gets so to me at me this point. Like, where's, my state of mind? Where's, your, where's your nation of mind? Where's your empire of mind? What do you think about Magalodon? You heard of that? I fucking Magalodon. You know, like Magalodon shark, Magalodon. I don't like that guy. I hope he runs again. Prima Donald. I have a bunch of good names for him. I hope he runs. Like, just, it would be fun. I don't want him to win if he runs, right? Little things can help. Deep fake Trump. Tr- it's funny. I, Trump. I brought my TV watch to zero mm-hmm. other than the occasional movie. I do not watch Background? We do music? Do or what's watch, your... I do not watch any TV at all. Politics. No sound or just no TV? I'm always working on my shit. What do you listen to? Uh, playing music, playing drums with it, and getting work ideas as a drum. Used to drums are great. Like I, I, like you, drums are great. I should, I should do a couple of drums. You have a lot of drums, probably too much for me. But a drum is a good thing to have. Can you know what if we invent a drum? What, what do you, what, 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 do, what do you love about drums? What, what, like, what's most important? Like what? There's no better feeling than being slow. And drums can direct access to it. And then it acts as a carrier wave for my ideas in the work of the day. Instead of me sitting in front of a computer working, I'm figuring shit out or like solving problems. Now I'm just drawn into the music, but the intention is hey, I need a, a solution for this, I need uh, an idea for this. It's in the back of my head. And as I drum, those ideas get worked on in the background and surface. I take a break, I write them down, type them down, I go back to drum. That's how I'm most effective with work. You want to switch it's amazing, but it's not working. Want a little bit for you? Or you? I don't know. It's what? Do you want to jump up in here? It's over there. It's like, it's like, do you want to smoke them like five in front of you? I forget my mom. Oh, hello, cutie. Hello, <laughs> you're super. That's probably so comfortable for that fucking dog. It's like a weird setup, but that might be really nice for a cheap ass smoke. I pulled that out of the garbage. That green, this green thing, they throw like so much good shit in here, dude. It's fucking great. Oh my god, that was the first thing off the space. Um, like it's like it's like knitted but huge you see that like it's huge feet it's huge that's like strings on strings on strings like that's, put, that's actually put, comfortable put, oh yeah well what, yeah there's it depends wow. it's, it's been pretty good yeah it distributes pretty nicely it spreads out kind of and seems to carry the force like better than the tempur if you put air in that and do it properly like into a weave the air can really distribute itself in very interesting ways Dude, why don't you you know what I'm why so- don't you take 10 percent of your time and think about engineering i'm serious don't do full time you're gonna go crazy why don't you take five percent i have zero think- interest in that zero you're talking about helping people's lives uh, i'm already i've already got my no, mission you're play. 100% it's on one track yeah no this is a multi-track but singular track no i i've got three lifetimes worth of content to produce yet no no i i'm, I'm clear I'm, I'm on my mission it's running <laughs> no i ain't gonna go into engineering for 0.001 percent of the time not I mean, like, thing there's all not the brilliant thing. shit around and you're not no, i'm simplifying my life you're so focused i'll look at your shit if yeah, you, see, like, you should look at i've been like this too now it's singular there's multiple facets within I'm, this I'm thing trying to do that, too. that doesn't mean i'm not gonna no. listen to you which is very different right i still listen to you i still look at the shit and listen to it it's not yeah. i'm not gonna like oh i'm gonna do that but if you're like how about 10 percent of your time you think about how you're doing this yeah it, and and how someone might be able to help you with it how i might be able to you write some words on think my way in terms of the wave how can it apply like you might ask me to try to integrate it into but like that's all i'm kind of saying in the, in the, in the reverse direction i'm a bit of an, uh, more of an instigator i guess <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> I suppose so. No, I'm singular now. I'm never going back. Simplify, simplify, simplify. And it's just happening by itself. Like, I went to the garage you know how much simpler my life is without getting caught up in the drama of politics and stuff? I watch from the periphery so I know just kind of sort of what's happening, but I, I don't go into the details at all anymore, period. Oh, politics and invention so, are different. It's just, uh, you know, both, or, or anything. Thing. For me, it'd be a distraction. I don't even have the option as far as I'm concerned. My body tells me, nope, you can't do it anymore. You just cannot continue to jump right out of the gutter. If you, want, if you ever wanted anybody to do, yeah, do what I do one day, turn on a camera or two cameras and leave them on all day. Put all the work you do in a day and send me that video. If you want, like, if you ever want advice, like, or perspective from me who is pretty unique like i have to i just it might affect your day though because you don't con like you only record like when you're recording right like it's yeah it's, see that fucks with you too that's that's why you're not as good at some things as me i do it all the time i don't turn the shit on and be like oh i gotta go i just leave it the fuck on and then there's no worries you just press you edit the start in you have the money to record everything you should figure out a way to yeah, spend a thousand on hard drives and turn these things on it fucking helps I, I, it, I it helps, and you're just saying, hey, do it. You yeah, have... but then it's a question of extracting morsels from those things. No, you can have another camera that you're only recording bits with. Like Leave a stupid was... camera on and have your good camera for the specific bits. But That's how you separate it. It's easy as fuck. Yeah, but it still has to be done. So it's I, easy. I, I could do one it. One of my roles for my virtual assistant is to go through my thousand plus live videos. And extract this. So she started the process. I think she done like a dozen videos. That's not even efficient enough. So uh, you can do I don't know. It's no too much that. content. You're you're, it's, you're, it's you're better now and more formal than you were before. You shouldn't go through that shit. There's no way you should be paying somebody to go through your old Facebooks. These are like how many minutes that it be? Make you make some new ones. It's just it's so much I work. Implying I should be doing it? No, you shouldn't do it. Right. Should, they, no one should be going through those. The, the past video you have, fuck it. So, Fuck most of it. So Keep it in our chat. Start fresh. Now, recording the whole day. Then with a shitty do it. Record. Put on a hard drive. And, and then it. what? It, you realize you're capturing everything. It changes your behavior. It'll help you. If it doesn't hurt you, which yep. it probably won't, it'll help you. Just leave it on. It'll cost so you a dollar a day. Content. It's the fact that it's on all the time. That well, time. well, then you have another one for your performance, and you can see yourself going on camera. You can see how you fucking change when you turn the camera on. You see things you do not see. I don't want you to do not not see, Carl. Do not Nazi. <laughs> We're international socialists, but we don't call ourselves that because it reminds people of Hitler. I don't know. I, okay. It has to do with what we're talking about. It does. A lot of people don't know like what I'm saying connect how it connects to another thing. Especially when the idea that I'm connecting to is made up. Then they really don't know like how it happened. I'm gonna make a deck of cards. And I'm gonna start I'm gonna make a deck of cards. I'm just gonna start walking around like I'm telling like like you to do. Yeah. No, just say to people, like, listen, pick a card, any card, that's my business card, there's 1,400. If you don't like the one you get, the universe does not want us to be business. Here we get. And I'll meet a bunch of people, and they'll look hard, and they'll look weird work. No, then I have, so I, if, I, if I had business cards, I'd be fine. Period at the end. Oh, that's not a period, that's a metaphorical period. Give the same effect. But they're not here. I've known you for fucking years. Like, they're not here. I'll know them for one minute. Rigid constructs of how I view situations. And I want to, for me, as fluid as I can, I come up with one interpretation, but then I come up with other possibilities. You hear that beep constantly, right? That's fucking... I do. What is... The, why the... I was going to ask you, what is that? It, and it's and it's recording into... Like it, so you don't know what that... Is. No, it's like somebody's messaging in, in, in some server, but it's not like... It's not the fucking one I'm in. It's not I, Discord? It's, uh, no, it, it is through Discord. Um, can't you mute the notification? I think I think it's fine just to do fucking whole piece of shit. Like, it can't be... You can't find something. That's fucking so stupid. I heard this last night, actually. I, I didn't hear it that much, but yeah, I'll turn, we're going to turn off all. Maybe it's, it's probably... Like, it can't come from this computer, right? Because, like, Discord on here, this acknowledges Discord on here. It records what's coming into Discord, not anything that goes into it. So it's got to be 
a, a, a different device that's sending that. You have a piece of paper and a marker or a pen something. You know what? Maybe maybe it actually is this fucking thing. It's just treating the permissions different because it's just a notification. All of an effect. That's gonna be so good. This is like maybe the best. I mean, I'm sorry, but it could be the best thing about today that we just realized that I'll drive myself crazy if I don't fix this. Like I don't need the scenes yet, but I do need this fucking beep to stop. Notification. Just shut the fuck up. Sounds disable all. Of, no, not all. Um. Could be somebody like joining a room, like. Oh, it's show. Wait, oh no, it's not showing. Oh, fuck, turn them off for now. I better stop it. I'm gonna fuck. Stop it. Stay stopped. Son of a bitch. Sheet. What is that from? I always say that.